Welcome to another presentation of Indies Education. In this video, I will demonstrate three different ways of powering Raspberry Pi 4. The first option to use the official Raspberry Pi power cable. I got my cable from PiHard.com and I mentioned the link from where you can buy the cable and it cost only £8. As you can see, I plug this cable and the Raspberry Pi 4 LED is on and it boots. For this cable, the pros are it is reliable and safest power option. The cons are it is expensive, need fixed AC power supply. The next option is to use the USB-C mobile phone charger to power your Raspberry Pi 4. Some tutorials suggest that not every USB-C charger works on Raspberry Pi 4. For me, this cable is working and this is a cheap one from Poundland. As you can see, I am connecting the cable. I plug it on. As soon as I connect it with the Raspberry Pi 4, the power LED is on and it boots, so it is working. The pros of this uh, is that uh, it is the cheapest one, it is easy to carry, basically any phone charger can work, uh, but uh, the cons are not all the USB-C works. The next option is to use the back converter with 12 volt battery power supply. The power rating of Raspberry Pi 4 is 5 volt and 3 amps and I will use the USB-C cable from the mobile phone charger. Here I split the cable and uh, there are four cables, uh, two is for data cable, the white and blue wire is for the data cable. So I separate these two cable and uh, I got left only the red and the black cable. Red is for plus supply and uh, black is for the minus supply. I will connect these uh, two cable to the back converter output port. Back converter convert 12 volt battery. Uh, to 5 volt to its output port. Here I have already connected to the output port. Now I will connect uh, the back converter to the battery. At this stage I haven't connected the Raspberry Pi yet. First I need to make sure the voltage is 5 volt 3 amps. The LED indicator in the back converter you see it will show only the voltage but not the current. For current measurement you need to use a multimeter to confirm that it has got five uh, it has got three amps current supply so as you can see i got the voltage of 4.9 volt but i need the five volt so i am adjusting with the knob so this is the way you can adjust the voltage using a screwdriver to rotate the screw of the buck converter that blue box has got the screw and this screw is for the voltage regulation. So I make the voltage right at 5 volt. You see I have measured the current using a multimeter and the current is 2.7 amps which is acceptable for back converter but uh, the data sheet said uh, that when you connect the Raspberry Pi 4 the current goes to 3 amps. So here I have adjusted the battery voltage, I mean the back converter output voltage. So it is 5 volt, 3 amps, it is ready for connection. I am connecting now. As soon as I connect it, as you can see the power LED is on and the back converter and the uh, Raspberry Pi 4 boots. In this way you can use uh, back converter battery combination to make a mobile power supply for Raspberry Pi 4 and this is applicable for mobile operation like mobile robotic operation, a remote operation. If you like this video, please like, comment, subscribe and share.